are we saw just now reversal chart pat chart patterns there are continuation chart pattern also wherein the trend will continue if you see this type of pattern the trend will continue we have triangles as a pattern rectangles as a pattern we have flag and pennants are the patterns okay triangles can be symmetrical triangle so it can be like this symmetrical okay wherein the observation will, will be like this okay we'll see example of all this ascending descending bullish bearish flag pattern and the pennant pattern let us see what are these so this is your ascending uh, triangle pattern in a ascending tri triangle pattern so what we have is okay see the pattern is that the stock price was increasing okay so it is the pattern will continue whatever was a pattern that we are observing it will continue after that and this is a triangle it will hit this okay uh, resistance line okay and from hitting that it will come back so if you see hit this and it will come back okay it is a now acting as a support line it will hit go to this resistance line come back support line so what is happening is the highs are lower this is high this is high this is lower highs and the lows are higher the lows are higher this low is higher than this and then once it breaches this triangle you can see that the trend will continue so please note that many people make mistake in a triangle pattern it has to start like this it is increasing so it will increase okay it cannot happen like a triangle pattern cannot be like this this cannot be a triangle pattern as an example this cannot be a triangle pattern it's a continuation it cannot like come down and then it can increase no it has to continue okay similarly you have a descending triangle you have two type of triangle pattern this is now your descending triangle see here the pattern is like decreasing so the prices are decreasing it will oscillate in between and finally once it break this line it will go down so this it is making lows are higher lows and higher lower highs okay and it is decreasing so it exactly like this but why it is descending because the final if you see this is acting as a resistance okay so you have this as a resistance and this is acting this is creating a pattern okay acting and previous case if you see okay uh, actually could be acting as a support then so what happens is like the continuation of the pattern will be observed if it is decreasing this will be decreasing another is like a symmetrical triangle okay symmetrical triangle will be like this if it is it will oscillate and it will go like this or it can be like this and it will go like this so this is your pattern so here if it is saying uh, lower highs and higher lows okay so that is the idea okay then you have a rectangle okay rectangle can be bullish or bearish okay as the name implies that these are continuation pattern the bullish rectangle will be see this is a increase in the price okay and then these are your resistance and the support line it will oscillate in between the support and resistance line and it will go beyond it okay so the this will continue so see it comes back again takes a support here but finally it will increase then this is a bearish rectangle this is the initial pattern go uh, take the support resistance etc and then final final is it will decrease so bullish and bearish rectangle okay it, it these are continuation pattern they will continue the trend okay as an example i was able to observe a bullish rectangle pattern in nifty see this the stock price is increasing okay it formed a in a rectangle see the rectangle it is going up going down and then it breaks it okay right in between you can observe some triangle also you can observe some let's say so some triangles can be observed so if it is decreasing it will decrease right so this is one thing you can observe here okay the it is decreasing so it will decrease like that but finally it goes up that is so the greater scheme of thing is this is the triangle it fit comes here go up go down down but finally it will breach and it will reach a higher uh, uh, prices okay then the flag so what is differentiating between the flag flag are are there for a very short term they are also continuation pattern very short term 1 2 3 weeks a flag is like this okay so you have seen any fl country's flag okay so flags are like this so this can be like this so these are like actually flag so 
they are for a very short time and they are very very uh, confirmatory pattern so if this is a downtrend okay so this will be after breaching the flag it will be downtrend it is similar to your rectangle pattern and uh, the pennant is similar to your uh, triangle pattern but these are observed for a very very short period of time usually 1 to 3 weeks is what is observed so this is a continuation pattern so decreasing okay go up down and then decrease so decreasing go up down decreasing so this is your flag pattern here also the volume plays a important role so this breach has to be on a higher volume so see this breach okay so the volume is higher than the usual okay then this is your pennant pattern note that pennant pattern looks like okay your uh, triangle but it is for a very short period of time it is observed these are the daily chart if you see okay it is for a very short period you see the it is a continuation pattern okay it was increasing and then after breaking out the stock price will increase so this is a pennant 